There are people whom Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says have started calling this young boy the son of God. Why was this? This was because they didn't see the father. To them there was no father. So when they were told this is, the, this is a miracle from Allah, they said, well, that is the son of Allah. And they started saying, this is the son of Allah. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, مَا كَانَ لِلَّهِ أَن يَتَّخِذَ مِن وَلَدَ Nay, it is not befitting for the creator to take a son, to have a begotten son. It is blaspheme to relate to the creator who only needs to say be and anything he wants to make is created automatically. It is blasphemous to relate to him to say he has a begotten son. May Allah safeguard us from such blasphemy. Na'udhu Billah. So in Islam, we believe to say that the God Almighty has a son is blasphemous. The Quran speaks about how sick that blasphemy is. And the Quran says, how can they say that Allah, the most merciful, has a son? And it is not befitting for the most merciful to have a son. Allah says, This statement is so blasphemous that the skies want to tear apart. And the earth wants to explode. And the mountains want to fall prostrate to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because of the severity and seriousness of such a dangerous statement against the maker himself. So even the creation of Allah are bearing witness that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has not taken a son. And they are agitated at the fact that people are saying this. Yes, he did not have a father, but Adam neither had a father nor a mother. And Eve neither had, meaning Eve did not have a, a mother. Meaning you, we cannot even call Adam the father. She was also created miraculously. And when it comes to Jesus, may peace be upon him, he did not have a father. That's what the Quran says. But you cannot say the son of Allah and the begotten. The word beget is so blasphemous. If you have to check the meaning of it in the Oxford Dictionary, you'd probably hide your face. May Allah protect us. How can we say that for the maker of the universe? He doesn't need that. He is powerful. We believe the maker only needs to say be and it is. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us goodness.